Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good night, depending on what part of the country you're located at. This is Jasir Jamal from Texas 1031 Exchanges, located down south of the country, of course. So today I want to go ahead and address a very frequently asked question. I mean, let me not say very. It could be very or it could not be very. It really depends. But nevertheless, let me go ahead and answer it just to clear it up. So you let's say you just closed on your relinquished property right now and unfortunately you found out about the idea of doing a 1031 exchange after you close on your relinquished property well then the question is can you do it unfortunately the answer is no because here's the thing we me or another qualified intermediary really needs to be um, involved in the closing process at least a week or two weeks before because the closing has to be structured a different way and then the funds have to be sent over to us so that we can hold it in an escrow account for you and it's just that you, the IRS does not want you to touch the money because once you sell your property and the money hits your bank account that's it you cannot do a 1031 exchange then you will be taxed at the end of the year and you will have to pay your capital gain taxes however here's another thing you just closed on your relinquished property and you figured out the idea of doing a 1031 exchange later on well here's the thing if the money is still is not in your bank account like any bank account that's owned by you or the entity that owned owned that relinquished property of yours if the money is somehow in some way still sitting with the title company for whatever reason you could do a 1031 in that case you can get us involved and we'll be happy to do a 1031 exchange but it's just that as long as the money does not hit your bank account and it's not in your hands or in your um, possession, then well, we should be good to go. But that's it for me today, folks. I thought I should go ahead and address this little question that could or could not come up. But that's it for me today. If you have any more questions, feel free to reach out. Until then, see you next time.